Anyway, uh, the title is uh, MIDI, fun, some fun projects with MIDI. Uh, MIDI is an awesome ancient uh, serial technology. Uh, it's something that uh, this picture it shows a couple people that uh, were uh, represented last uh, evening. Uh, Dave Smith, who's here in San Francisco, uh, as sequential circuits, and he has his own DSI uh, company. Uh, he did the Profit uh, uh, series of synthesizers. Uh, Aikutoro uh, Kakahashi, I'm probably mispronouncing that. Um, he's like one of the big guys on here because he invented the TR-909 uh, and the, T, uh, the TB-303. So pretty much if you've heard electronic dance music in the last 20 years, he's the one to blame. Um, and Bob Moog, of course, who uh, did the Moog synthesizer in the 60s and 70s. Uh, the, the guy in the end is Tom, o Tom Oberheim, another analog synth god. Um, but uh, in 1983, two different vendors brought two different keyboards that could talk to each other over MIDI. And that's, that's like Coke and Pepsi uh, working together. Uh, anyway, it's something that, that's a Jupiter 6 and a Prophet 600. Uh, again, this is uh, beginning of 1983. So this is MIDI. Uh, it's both a cable protocol as well as a, uh, a communications protocol. Very easy, note on, note off. This is not for audio, this is for music events. So like controllers and changing patches and playing notes. So uh, this is a mini Moog. Um, it's something that uh, you can get them used now for anywhere from three to six thousand bucks, or you can go out and get a Behringer Model D, which is the exact same circuitry for three hundred dollars. And so, if you had a time machine and can go back to last night, you would see me playing with one on a table out there in the makerspace. So uh, that is that part. Let me show you some code. This will take just two seconds. And the relevant code is is very, let's make this big, hold on, should have thought of the, uh, there we go, all right. So um, there's, a, there's a segment here, this is just, is that my two minute warning? Okay. <laughs> um, okay, uh, yeah, so, the, so basically import RT MIDI, uh, there's a section here, if you look in the, uh, um, Examples that comes with RT MIDI. It shows how to open up a port. It's just a couple lines. Uh, there's a thing for turning off the last note. Uh, there's a whole bunch of uh, uh, these are things to translate English uh, notes because I don't think in terms of MIDI numbers. I think in terms of like C C3 C4, um, and so that's just a little lookup table. And then there's two lines of Python down here: note on and note off. And, and the rest is just how much time to keep them on. So just a few lines of code and you can do the on the run music from Pink Floyd. So anyway, it's a lot of fun. Uh, so I wanted to say is three words with some extra words in between. Um, uh, Python and uh, MIDI is very easy. The Mini Moog from Behringer is very cheap and putting them together is very fun. So thank you.